transformed the earth into a strange and hellish garden, a venomoid nursery for the alien plant life which is spewing its deadly spores into the earth's biosphere. From his headquarters on the dark side of the moon, Darkon, commander of the alien forces, uses long-range biotech sensors to receive updated reports from his Tectoman warriors on Earth. All goes according to plan. Yes, Darkon. There are two items which concern me. Firstly, the disbursement of the spore plants. There are still some target zones which have not been properly saturated. This error must be corrected. Even more important, the Technoman blade is still alive. He must be destroyed as soon as possible. He'll be taken care of soon. I have a plan. Excellent. I'm glad to hear it. Explain this plan of yours. Blade and his friends, the Space Knights, believe that the only way they can defeat us is to attack your base on the moon. But at present, they have no way to get there. I see. Very well, go on. My crystal. Since that's what Blade needs, he'll come after me to get it. <laughs> yes, you're right. He will. And then... I'll easily lure him to my trap by making it appear as though he's found me rather than the other way around. <laughs> he thinks this crystal will save him and his friends, but in fact it will do exactly the opposite, because this crystal is what's going to destroy him. And then nothing will stand in our way. The planet Earth shall be ours. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know why it was necessary for all of you to come along on this trip. If you had a breakdown, just how would you handle the repairs yourself? I'm not planning on a breakdown. Who does? Look, this is going to be a very messy fight. Axe is extremely dangerous. I know him. That bad? But to go in without any weapons? That's the way it's got to be. I've got no choice. Can you win? If he doesn't, we're in real trouble. The whole planet is. Oh, Blade, do you really think you can get to the moon? Oh, I have a plan. This. That? A piece of crystal? Shara's crystal. Shara, right. This is all I have left of my sister. Her powers, her crystal. It was just weeks after the Space Knights Command Center had been destroyed. After I lost Char. The sky was darkened by the alien invasion, and I could only watch and remember. No, Saber! Please, don't! I can't just sit here! Pegasus, open interlock! Affirmative. There's so much power. Filled with rage. I didn't stop to think. I just roared upward in the techno bar. The spider crowd were destroyed as I passed. Upward I flew so fast I couldn't breathe. Then the techno transformation. When it was over and I had left the interlock chamber, I could hardly believe what I saw. In that short space of time, I had traveled thousands of miles. I was floating weightless in space, only a few feet from the orbital ring. The beautiful blues and greens of the Earth below me. Char's crystal had taken me further and faster than I could have ever imagined on my own. Just this one small piece of it. It's a constant reminder of how much I've lost and how much my sister gave back to me. With a complete crystal, there would be so much power I could go to the moon and destroy Darkon's base there.
What is it, Gringo? I don't like the looks of this. Those venomoid trees are getting really thick up there. Stop here or go on? Keep going. Axe is in there calling me. I've got to go in and meet him. Our future depends on it. Blade, I'm waiting for you. It's been quite a while. Let's get reacquainted, shall we? I don't know. Are you sure about this blade? Yes. Keep going. Guys, I think we got a little problem here. Nice job, pal. Great. If you broke it, then I'm going to have to fix it. Man. Let's move it. Man, we're really stuck. Oh, no. Even our four-wheel drive won't get us out of this muck. Looks like we're at the end of the line. Blade, wait. Stay here. Where are you going? Blade. Wait up. Hey. I'll be back. I told you I didn't like the looks of these woods. That makes two of us, partner. We've got to get out of here. Blade! Blade! Blade. Blade. I'm so glad you were able to come. You have no idea how much I've been looking forward to this little get-together. <laughs> I didn't come here to play games, Axe. Why did you call me here? What do you want? Oh, nothing much. I know you're a busy man, so I'll get right to the point. It's really quite simple, in fact. I'll bet you already know the answer. I called you here in order to destroy you. <laughs> hey, great hunter, it's obvious we should have been on foot from the very beginning. Why didn't you suggest it now, now, children? Stop arguing and I'll buy you some ice cream. Oh, goody, goody, goody. You knew I was coming. I knew you were here. Now what? It's really strange how things turn out. I trained your whole family to fight, but I never expected you to use it on each other. Your father's gone. Your sister's gone. Your brother, well, he's not in good shape. And you, what about you, Blade? What kind of shape are you in? You've got no family, you've got no crystal. What you really need is a good friend. <laughs> Don't you think? Darkon is willing to take you back. Honestly, aren't you getting tired of fighting against your own future? Listen, it'll be just like before, only better. Believe me. Huh. No thank you. Don't be hasty. Give it some thought. <sighs> Never. Never is an awfully long time, son. meeting Axe in a cathedral? It used to be beautiful. I'm glad it's still standing. There aren't many left. Let's go. Huh? What's it doing? Look out! Blade, I'm afraid you're every bit as hard-headed as you were when I was training you. I can respect that. I admire you. And I admire your brother as well. Difference is, you're a traitor! Yeah! To protect your brother, Saber, I'll destroy you! Just like the old days. 
Sometimes you'd rather defend yourself than fight! I would count on that if I were you. What is that thing? What's it doing? What's the matter? Flowing down? Yeah! Don't you remember, Blade? If you make the same moves every time, you'll always be beaten. Well, my friend, it appears as though you've learned something after all. But then you always were a good student. Pegas! Power on! I gave you every chance, Blade. You've sown disrespect. Now you're going to reap the whirlwind. Oh, yeah? Pegas! Now! Maybe your robot's a little tied up. Huh? That's impossible! Mobility nullified. Insufficient power. It was a trap! What do we do now? How do we help Blade? Well, we don't. Not with Pegasus out of action. No Matt, way. Isn't there some way of dissolving that stuff? How should I know? Out of the way! Coming through! Let's get this through! It's like fighting bubblegum with brains! Watch out! What now? This stuff is awful tough! We've got to do something to help Blade! Oh. That's it, coward! Run away! It's no use! you to leave. We don't want you to leave now or ever. And now, my friend, it's time to say goodbye. What? Huh? Sorry we kept you waiting. Get Blade out of here. I'll cover you. You got it. Why didn't Pegasus ever show up? It's not his fault. Look. Oh, no. That stuff has him trapped. What is it? Solidified spider crab goo. He can't come to you, so you'll go to him. Get ready. Quick, Blade, make your move. Pegasus, open the interlock. Affirmative. I got one chance, so make it good! 